Hi, my name is Leilani, and I'm a field trip tour guide at Gateway Science Museum. Here's another Wildlife Wonders video. This week, we're talking about birds' beds. Keep watching just to see how creative birds can be. There are six different types of nests. The scrape nest, the burrow, the cavity, the platform, the cupped, the ground, or the mound's nest. Scrape nest. These are scrapes or divots into the ground. They can be made out of stones, leaves, twigs, moss, and shells. Parents sit and push their body and wiggle around to create the divot. This helps eggs from rolling away. Their speckled design on their shell helps them camouflage into the ground to avoid predators. Typically, foragers of the ground are the ones that create these types of nests, and they can be found in the desert. If you haven't watched our Wildlife Wonders video from last week, Morgan talks all about bios, so click over there to learn more. And these are the types of birds that create scrape nets. The plover, the sandpiper, the gull, and the terns. Burrow nest. These are a shallow cave or a tunnel leading to a nest. They could be made out of mud or material that they could peck or carve into with their beak. These are sometimes just old habitats of squirrels or prairie dogs, and they can be found in the ground or a cliffside. This helps protect against predators and cold temperatures, and you can find them in grassland, coastal, or savanna areas. And these are the types of birds that make burrowing nests. The bank swallows, the belted kingfisher, and the burrowing owl. Cavity nests. These are open areas inside a tree. They can also be birdhouses that humans put up for them. Or they can even be made out of moss, dry grasses, and fungi. These are the types of birds that create cavity nests. Primary cavity nesters build their own nests, just like the woodpecker. Secondary cavity nesters use old nests made by primary cavity nesters just like the sparrow or the owl, or they just find natural cavities. Platform nests. These are flat nests on the ground, in a tree, or debris in shallow water. These birds reuse and add material every year to the same nest on the next nesting season. They're made out of large twigs, small branches, and sticks, and you can find them in woodland and grassland areas. And these are the types of birds that make platform nests. The bald eagle, the morning doves, the white stork, the osprey, and the egret. Cup nest. These are cup-shaped nests. They are made out of grasses, twigs, and held together with mud, their own saliva, and spider webs. These nests help with insulation to keep the eggs warm. You can find these in the forest, grassland, or woodland areas. And there are four different types of cup nests. It's just based on how the tree supports the nest. And these are the types of birds that create cup nests. The barn swallows, the hummingbird, yellow warblers, and the robin. Ooh. 
ground or mound nest. These are tall coned or bell-shaped nests. The sides create a dome structure. These nests help keep warmth inside and protects against predators. They are made out of mud, branches, sticks, twigs, and leaves. Males are the ones that are in charge of building the nest and maintaining the temperature so when the female lays her eggs, the temperature is just right and they reuse the nest during the next nesting season. And these are the types of birds that create ground or mound nest. You have the Mali fowl, the Adelie penguin, the flamingo, and the horned coot. If you enjoyed this week's topic, keep watching to the end of the video for more fun. And tune in every Wednesday of May and June to get more wildlife wonder fun. With all this knowledge, I challenge you to go in your backyard or go on a walk and see if you can find a nest. Identify it. Which one does it look like? Then you're gonna sketch it out. Look at all the little details that the birds put into the nest. Then you're gonna reverse engineer the nest. How do you do that? Well, you're gonna redesign it by collecting materials such as mud, sticks, leaves, or if you wanna get even more creative, use household items such as pipe cleaners, Q-tips, anything that you think that would work well to recreate your nest. Have fun and good luck. Thank you.